Hi, in today's tutorial, we'll look at the magnetic quantum number uh, ML. ML has integral values uh, between L and minus L, including zero. The value of ML relates relates to the orientation orientation of the orbital in space relative to other orbitals in the atom we can now look at uh, quantum numbers uh, for the first uh, four levels of orbitals in the hydrogen atom. Quantum numbers for first four levels of orbitals in hydrogen atom. N, L, sub-level, sub-level designation, then here we have the value of ML, ML, then number of orbitals. When N is equal to 1, L is equal to 0. This is the S orbital, energy level 1. ML, ML in this case is 0, number of orbitals 1. When N is equal to 2, L has values 0, 1. We know that uh, L runs from 0 to N minus 1. So in this case, uh, when L is equal to 0, uh, this is 2, 2S, number of orbitals, ML 0, number of orbitals, 1. When L is equal to 1, this is the P orbital, energy level 2, this is 2P. Then ML, in this case, will be negative 1. 0, 1. I mean orbitals, 3. When L, when N is equal to 3, L has value 0, 1, 2. This is 3S, 0, 1. This is 3P, Then L, M, L, in this case, will have negative 1, 0, 1. Number of orbitals, 3. When uh, L is 2, in this case, this is 3, D. Number of M, M, L value, in this case, will have negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. D orbital has 5, uh, 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 the D subshell has 5 orbitals. Then we go to 4. When N is equal to 4, number of L values, one, 0, 1, 2, 3. This is 4S. L zero ML zero one. When uh, L is one, in this case this is four P negative one zero one three. When L is two, this is four uh, D. Negative 2, 
negative 1, 0, 1, 2. 5. When L is 3, this is 4, F, negative 3, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So the F orbital uh, has uh, the 7. Uh, this, the F subshell has 7 uh, orbitals. So this is how we can uh, find the, the number of orbitals for these uh, quantum numbers. As you can see, the S orbital has uh, the S, the sublevel. S has one subshell, then the P has three, D five, F uh, seven. So now let's look at the formula on which, uh, which we can use uh, to calculate uh, uh, sublevels. Number, number of orbitals a sub a sub shell is equal to two L plus one. So in this case, when L when L is equal to zero, we have two. This is zero, 1. So this is uh, S, S orbital. So S orbital has 1. When L is 1, this is 2, 1 plus 1, which is equal to 3. We know that 3 is the P orbital. When L is 2, this is 2, 2, Four, then five. Five, we know it's D orbital. When L is three, we have two, three, seven. Seven, we know it's F orbital. So this is the formula we can use to calculate the number of orbitals per, per subshell. Then the number of orbitals per shell number of orbitals per share is equal to n squared. You simply square the principal quantum number, then you get the number of shares per orbital. So this is how we can calculate uh, the, the number of orbitals in subshells and in shells. So we can use the formula or we can uh, do it the way I've done it. Thank you. So in the next uh, tutorial, we'll look at the quantum numbers and the electronic uh, configuration. Thank you.